Hi, I'm Christine from the Low Carb Planner and welcome my friend to another great recipe. Today we'll make the best low carb pretzels in the world. They are low carb, gluten free and sugar free. And they're super easy to make. It was a fan request. Thank you Dolce Loves Donuts. This recipe is wonderful if you miss bread in your low carb diet, especially pretzels. Now a small side note, if you want me to swap one of your favorite recipes into low carb, please let me know in the comment section below what I can cook for you. Okay, let's stop talking and let's do it. The recipe will be in the description box below or go to lowcarbplanner.com and subscribe to the food letter and I'll send you every week a new recipe. The first thing you need to hear be really quick. You'll need 200 grams of grated cheese. I use here mozzarella and heat it up in a microwave for two minutes until it's fully melted. Next, we'll add two eggs and incorporate it into the hot cheese dough. Now comes the magic. I add one teaspoon of baking soda into the egg cheese mixture and you'll see it puffs, but keep stirring. Now we add one at a time almond flour. I use here 200 grams, but most of the times I use between 100 and 150 grams. It should be, shouldn't be too wet because that makes it hard to shape it. You can use coconut flour if you want to, but I never use it for this recipe. Now shape it into a long sausage. then fold one end to one edge and then the other end to the other edge. If it's too short, try to shape it longer. I know it's not easy, but you need a little bit of practice. This dough makes about four pretzels, or like I do it this time, two pretzels and two buns. If you want to be perfect, you can cut the dough into four perfect sized pieces. But I'm a bit in a rush and prepare this video for you because this is a great recipe. Okay, bake the pretzels on 200 degrees Fahrenheit, which is for my US friends 392 degrees Fahrenheit for 15 minutes. As you see, they are perfectly puffed and wait until they are cool down, then it's easier to cut. One important side note, those pretzels don't taste like cheese at all. So I hope you liked that video. Let me know in the comment section below what I can do for you next time. Please give this video a thumbs up. See you next Saturday, same time, same place. Thank you for watching.